Hey, what is going on guys? It is Young here and today I'm back with another Fortnite tips and tricks video for you guys and in today's video I'm going to be talking about building in Fortnite and I'm specifically going to be talking about the materials in Fortnite and exactly why I think brick is the worst material of all time. It is the worst material to use in Fortnite and something you should definitely avoid using if you have the opportunity to. And I'm going to go in depth and explain exactly why I have that opinion and why I think Brick is absolutely garbage. And before we get to the video, at 30,000 subscribers, I will be doing a V-Buck giveaway. And this is the last video to enter that giveaway. If you guys want to win some free V-Bucks, all you have to do is drop a like on this video. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel, turn on those notifications, and comment down below either your Xbox Gamer Tag, PSN Gamer Tag, or Epic account. Like I said, this is the last chance to enter that giveaway. I will be announcing the winners of that giveaway in my next video, so make sure you guys are entered. And alright guys, let's get right to the video. Alright, so I'm going to be showing you guys exactly why I think Brick is the worst material to use in, in Fortnite, especially if you're trying to build up on a guy, or maybe even like a small build fight, or even a build fight. It is the worst material to use, and I'm going to explain exactly why I think it's the worst. Using Brick to fight, or using Brick to get into gunfights, it is the biggest cuck. I swear, I, I I put it on everything. It is the biggest cuck in Fortnite, and you're going to get screwed so many times if you're trying to build with Brick. So I'm going to show you guys exactly why and you guys are going to understand you guys are going to feel my pain on why brick is so bad to use it is so bad I can't even stress it enough. Alright so here I'm in playground and I'm going to get some so right now I'm going to get some wood get my wood up and then I'm going to get some brick and then I'm going to get some steel and I'm going to compare the three materials and I'm going to show you you know the pros and cons of each material and then I'm going to show you guys exactly why I don't, know when, I, don't know, I don't know why anybody doesn't talk about this but I'm going to talk about why brick is such a cuck in Fortnite it is the biggest cuck known to man so I got some wood and I'm getting steel right here and then I'm going to go get the cuck material and I'm going to compare all three of them and when it comes to brick honestly it's not even the health factor that makes it such a cuck or makes it so bad you guys are going to see exactly what I mean by it. Alright, so here's my platform. I'm going to put up wood first. And so when you put up wood, it starts out uh, it starts out at exactly 90 health. So it goes to 90 health and then it builds up very quickly 150. I think, it, I think of all the materials, this one builds up the fastest. And then it goes brick and then it goes steel. But the initial starting health, like right when you place the health that you get on wood is the lowest of all three. It was kind of in a recent update where they changed it. It used to be where, uh, what, what was it, that the wood... It started out the highest rate, so it would be the best to build with. And honestly, I still like building with wood because it's the easiest material to gather and steel is not as easy. If you want to get a lot of steel, go places like Junk Junction or places with a lot of crates and you're going to get a ton of steel there. So even with steel having the most initial health and would be ultimately one of the best materials to build with, finding wood is a ton, is, it's a ton easier, tenfold easier. And you can get a lot more wood faster than you would with steel or even brick. So the starting health of wood is at 90, brick is at 99, and steel is at 110. So that gives you guys a little bit of comparison of the materials. One thing to keep in mind, a little side note, after you edit, or you edit a wall, or you edit any structure, it completely loses all of its health, so it makes it one shot. So you can see, after I edit this wall, the health goes immediately down to 20 or 30 even it could be a completely max health but if you go to edit it and as soon as you finish editing it goes all the way down to one shot and that's something to keep in mind when you're going for edit plays or you're trying to do anything you know, along with editing that as soon as you do the edit you lose all of your health in your wall so it's completely one shot so if there's people nearby and they're shooting at you and you go for an edit just know that they can destroy the entire wall in one shot or even one pickaxe it's completely vulnerable the second you edit you're completely out so here i have all the materials side by side at first glance look right here at first glance everything looks straight everything looks normal but you guys are about to see exactly what i mean by when you rush up on somebody brick is the last material you want to use and build fights the last material unless you're in desperate need you're out of wood you're out of steel you're out of everything and you just have to use brick and then that is a uh, that's obviously a situation where you would use brick but otherwise, I wouldn't even use brick. So here, as you can see, I'm double ramp brush with walls all the way up. And it's it's very clean. I can see exactly where everybody's at. So when I'm rushing up on somebody, I can see the entire area, my field of vision. Really good. I can I, I can see everything. I can see everything. It's it's too it's too good. It's too good. But you guys are about to see as soon as I switch to brick, as soon as I go to brick, it's it's completely different story. It's a completely different story. So you guys are about to see. And I'm just going to go over here because I want to I want a little bit too high. So I'm going to go over here. I'm going to do the exact same thing as I was with the wood. 
and do it with the brick and see exactly. So if you see, just look how cooked this is. Like honestly, can you see through this brick? You cannot see through the brick whatsoever. So imagine you're trying to rush up on a guy and you have to. You you have no idea where they're at and you're trying to figure out where they are. If you're rushing up with brick, you can't see for anything. That is why it's such a cuck. That's why it's so bad to use in build fights because you can't see. You can't freaking see. And, and other than wood and when it comes to steel, how you can see through it. But when it comes to brick, like it's such a cuck. I can honestly, and I had a really good example when I double ramp rush with walls. I did with brick and then I also just did the double ramp with brick. If there was no sound, you couldn't tell that I actually put the walls down. And that's something that's really important. Or if you're even just practicing, if you think about it, if you're trying to practice with brick, you can't even tell. You can't even tell that you put your walls down in front. That's why it is a, such a cuck, bro. I'm telling you guys, it is such a cuck. I have so many chances. And another really good situation that I get into a, quite a bit of times, especially in Season 5, because everybody's spraying at me. Is I have I'm, like I'm putting a wall down and they're keep shooting at the wall The best thing I can do or is a situation that I like to get out of that situation Like the way I like to get out of something like that when I when they're just cornered me down and they're just spraying on my wall Is I let them shoot it a few times and then at a random time after they shoot it I know exactly where they are I'll just pull up my shotgun and I'll take a quick shot and then I'll put my wall down again So I, I still sit back but I but I take my shotgun out and I get a quick shot on them and then I put it back But with brick I can't see through it there's nothing I can do. So as soon as they break it, and when it comes to doing something like that, you have to be very quick. Because if not, like I said, they're just spraying. They're gonna just completely melt you. You have to be. You have to get a very quick shot. And you're very good at it. A lot of times, you're not gonna take any damage. You can get off a 60 or 70 damage shot. But if you're using brick, oh, just forget it. Just don't even use brick. It's it's horrible. You can't see. You're gonna get cucked. Honestly, it just, it just feels bad. It's horrible. It's horrible. It's worse than t it's worse than taking out the double pump. All right, okay, it's not that bad. It's not that bad, but still, it's pretty bad. And that's just something that I started to you know really notice. Like it's something like I kind of noticed, but I didn't really think about a whole lot. But I was just playing like earlier, and I was just getting into build fight after build fight, and I was using I had brick out, and I just I couldn't see. Like I was rushing up on a guy, and I couldn't see if he was pushing me or if he went out to the side or what he was doing. But of course, since the, the, the initial health of brick is a little bit higher than wood, technically it would be better. But honestly, the situations where it would be better is when you're just protecting yourself from a little bit of a distance. Or you're just trying to get some walls up there that are a little bit stronger than wood. Other than that, when it comes to build fights, it's all about wood is the best way to go. Or actually, steel would be the best way to go. But of course, it's not as abundant and it's harder to find. And wood is a ton easier, so that's why I've been using wood, and that's why everybody uses wood, because it's just a ton easier to find. The initial health is still pretty good, and it's not brick, so that's why everybody uses wood. But for me, this is just a problem that I see when it comes to brick. But look in the situation how I'm using wood, and I can see everything that's going on. If I was using brick in the situation, I, could, I would have no idea where these guys were at. But when it comes to steel or wood, I can see right through it. I can tell if someone's pushing me, if they're moving out to the side. And that's why Brick is such a cuck in this. I, I can't, I, I have no words. I have no words, guys. I have no words. So what I would recommend is just focusing on wood, focusing on steel, and trying to get those mats up. Because those are really, really important. So obviously, instead of going for Brick, you know, Brick is always a good, you know, backup to have. But always try to focus on getting your wood up because that's gonna that's what's gonna save you and that's gonna win you those build fights. When I'm playing Fortnite, for me, honestly, when I play, I always try to have at least 500 wood. That's just kind of a rule of thumb I like to have. Of course, not always gonna have that, but that is a rule of thumb what I would like to have. Always like to have at least 500 wood and just uh, at least 100 brick, 100 steel. Just so I have a decent amount of mats, just in case I get sprayed. Because you know it's season 5. You know it's season 5. You're going to have the situations where you're going to get absolutely hammered with rounds after round. And just having a good amount of materials saved up is very, very important. So for me, like I said, about 500 wood. And of course, I like to have 100 or so brick, 100 or so steel. Just in case, as a backup, when I run out of wood. But always, like I said, always try to prioritize on wood. Try to get that up. And I guarantee you, it's going to help you out in the long run and winning those games in Fortnite. And alright guys, that's gonna happen for this video. I hope you guys learned something. I hope you guys understand my point and why I think brick is the worst material in Fortnite. And why I think Epic would actually... I, w I wish they would fix it. I wish they would make it so you can see through brick like how you can see through wood and steel. I think that would be really beneficial to the game. 
because honestly, Brick at its current state, I don't like it. I think it's pretty trash, and it's definitely not something that I'm going to be using a ton. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like on this video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Turn on my notifications so you're notified for every single new video. And alright guys, I will see you in the next video.